Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, today, I rise to urge the passage of the Herschel Woody Williams National Medal of Honor Monument Location Act. Uh, this, this Medal of Honor is our nation, the Medal of Honor is our nation's highest military decoration that is awarded to U.S. service members who have distinguished themselves with extraordinary acts of valor and sacrifice that far exceed the call of duty. Uh, Texas, my home state, is home to over seven, 70 valiant Medal of Honor recipients, and we also have over one million uh, veterans, uh, both uh, uh, veterans and active duty military that like to call the Lone Star State their home. Uh, that is why I teamed up with my good friend Blake Morgan uh, uh, to lead uh, the passage uh, of this act. Uh, last year, we had the opportunity to work uh, on a designation uh, for a National Medal of Honor Museum being built in Arlington, Texas. That was in my district at the time. Uh, and this bill is going to be amazing uh, as it authorizes a monument right here uh, in Washington, D.C. Uh, for Medal of Honor recipients' families, uh, their friends, their loved ones, uh, and people that want to learn more about the history of the Medal of Honor, to be able to come uh, to D.C. Uh, and see why it's important that we create this lasting uh, impact uh, to the recipients of this highest award. Uh, today's bill, the Herschel uh, Woody Williams National Medal of Honor Lo Monument Location Act is a continuation uh, of the efforts uh, that we worked on last year and will position this monument where it rightfully belongs uh, near the Lincoln Memorial uh, honoring President Lincoln, uh, who was awarded uh, one of the first Medals of Honor in 1863. Uh, I want to end today by thanking Congressman Moore for continuing to work with me on this important issue, and I urge my colleagues to support uh, this new bill that commemorates the bravery uh, service and sacrifice of more than 3,500, more than 3,500, Mr. Speaker, uh, Medal of Honor recipients uh, that have lived uh, across our communities here in the USA. I yield back the balance of my time.